So I have this spirit box going, a portal, but I heard a guy, disembodied voice, saying something to me. I could not make it out, though. Who spoke? What were you trying to say? Say it in the box. I need you to speak loud and clear, please. Speak slow and loud. And if you could light up something on the bed. They've been lighting up the pyramid all night. Ocean, py Ocean Pyramid. I don't know what it's actually called. and I should probably know that, but I don't. Can you light up the purple lantern, please? Or the... Oh, they lit up the pyramid. Okay, thank you. How about the purple lantern? Can you make the purple lantern light up to the top? Let's see the K2s are going off. Not the pyramid, the purple lantern. Do you see the violet purple light? By the teddy bear. What was that? Definitely seeing the K2 is blinking. The TV turned off. We're watching some ghost shows on YouTube. On TV. Some of them are obviously fake. It's really disappointing that people fake stuff, things being moved and thrown, and that rarely happens. It takes like a poltergeist or a demon or, I mean, a regular ghost can do it too if they muster up enough energy or if there's multiple of them, I think, but, I mean, I've seen it happen, but never, don't catch it on video, damn it. Except for one of the cat balls at one of the schools I used to work at, I did see it move there, but, oops, that just flashed, what was that? I picked up something on the bed, can you do that again, the GS2 here? Are you on the bed? I would use the connect, but I got the dog in my lap because she's scared. Something scared her earlier, and I think they might have done it again. Did one of you touch the dog a little while ago? Talking to the portal box on the bed. I don't know what that was. It sounded like a grunt. Who is here? I need to know your name so I can address you. Is Robert here? Robert, Bob. Was that? Yeah, these things flashes on there. Pew, Sasha, you're cutting some stinky farts. And the pyramid went off. Didn't you go to the bathroom when I was out there watering? Mm -hmm. Um, hmm, can you light up a REM pod? Something that makes a lot of noise?
Who is here? You guys are not chatty tonight. I haven't. You haven't? That was a weird low but clear voice. What is your name? I don't recognize your voice. Why am I getting the name Andy? Are you Andy? Is there a spirit here named Andy? Hello? Are you Andy? Yeah, it is tracking something. I don't know if you can see my finger on here, but... <laughs> What's that? Do you spirits scare Sasha sometimes? On purpose? It's like tracking a cold spot and a, a hot spot, I guess. More cold spots. So you guys are, I don't know if you're on hiatus or what. Where are you? Do you need help? I can't hear you. You have to try harder to come through louder. Speak in the little box on the top of the bigger box. Are you looking for help or do you have a message? Or are you here to help me? What was that? <laughs> Who is the young guy and the woman I'm hearing? Bang her up. What? Are you talking to another spirit? That's not a nice thing to say, a banger up. What does that mean? Are you talking about sexual or hurting somebody? I'm looking on the TV here and I'm seeing people who claim to have been to hell, I guess in your death experience. Have you spirits been to hell? I don't think I've ordered it that way before. I keep, ooh, chair just shook. Um, I could not hear you. Seeing K2's flickering over there. Have you been to hell or are you in hell? Should come through, come through clearer like they were earlier. I'm afraid to pull out the antenna because I might get more radio. Come closer to the box on the bed. I can't hear you.
I'm gonna turn on the flash. See if there's any <coughs> orbs or light anomalies or shadow figures, which are creepy. Actually, they're all kind of creepy. Can you come towards the light of my phone? So I could take your, well, not take your picture, but video you. Hmm. You guys are really having trouble coming through clear on there. Might pull out the antenna, but I think I'll get more radio. Since I'm in the city, you know, in town. <laughs> what did you say about distance? That's the same guy. <laughs> did you say something's evil? Hello? I think I heard, yeah, I just heard evil again. What's evil? What are you talking about? Evil. I heard monotone woman. I don't know her name. That's what I call her. She's the one that said the evil. She kind of warns me of stuff. So I guess she's a good spirit. I don't know. She just doesn't really sound like one, but... Is there something evil here, ma'am? I don't welcome anything evil here. You have to leave and go back to where you came. If you are evil or if you have negative intentions, malevolent intentions. Is it ever? Does it ever? So since they're saying that, I'm going to say some prayers. Don't be surprised if they quit talking. At least afterwards. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us of our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. That is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, now and forever. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy own Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Michael, the Archangel, defend us in battle, be our safeguard against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke them, we humbly pray, and do thou, Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits that wander through the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Do not welcome any evil spirits here. You go back to where you came. I couldn't hear you. Voice of what? Michael the Archangel protects me and my family. He's helped before with demonic cases in the past. I believe also Raphael helps as well. Do you 
spirits love Jesus. Do you spirits love Jesus? Are you looking for salvation? So they got pretty quiet. That's pretty typical after some prayers. Maybe a few decent spirits will come through. That's not to imply they're all evil by any means, but they said something's evil here, so... A lot of times nothing happens when they say stuff like that. It's kind of a bluff or a... I don't know. Or maybe the spirit can't do anything. Because I do believe in Christ and I'm a Christian and I do have religious relics here. What was that? So, yeah, kind of noticing them not lighting up stuff on the bed too. It could be because of the flash as well. Oh, the flash. oh, you don't like the flash? I just heard her say flash. I'm sorry if that was blinding you or bothering you. Image. Image? So who am I speaking to now? I hear two different women. Is one of you Stephanie? I'm not Stephanie, um, Kathy. Is one of you Kathy? Actually, I think I've heard Stephanie too here. It's hard to keep track. I've heard so many spirit names. But a lot of times they don't tell me or don't want to. But I have heard a lot over... What, how long have I been doing this in the house? Um... Probably a couple of years at least. Maybe more. Since the ghost tour is probably three, four. I don't know. People say it's not good to do spirit box sessions in your home and that can be the case. It just there's so many factors that you know, just like you wouldn't invite a stranger in your home because you don't know what might happen. I heard something about customer. What'd you say? But I mean, you're opening a. I don't know if you're opening a portal, but you're opening <coughs> communication to anyone. And me being a medium, that they're drawn to me. So if you're a medium, psychic, empath, sensitive. Spirits are drawn to you, so you're more likely to encounter. Did you say something about Rose? That's an old lady that died here a long time ago. Is Rose here? Is Richard here from next door who passed away recently? I'm hoping he just went to heaven. Not stuck here. I'm assuming he was a good person and Well, he was a teacher. I'm not, I think he had some other job too, but one time, but teacher one time. Hmm. 
Loquat. I think you said loquat. Kind of funny because I want to plant a loquat. But some of the stuff they say like that is relevant. Like earlier they said Cipro, that's an antibiotic my father's been on. How long is my dad going to be in the hospital? Do you know? Did I imagine that? I thought I saw some flickering light under the bed a few seconds ago. Go back and play that and see.